I think we've managed to go all 15 minutes without mentioning the football, but let's celebrate while we can. It's a strange feeling, isn't it? Even more so for the fans who actually witnessed England getting to their first major final in over 50 years. And of course, we've got to do it all over again on Sunday. Thea Chikomba has been speaking to fans young and old. The moment hundreds of fans were waiting for. Celebrations erupted at Soham Town Rangers Football Club as England beat Denmark to get into the Euros final. For this group of fans from Northamptonshire, they were fortunate to experience the game at Wembley. You know, once in a lifetime opportunity, being at Wembley to watch England in the major tournament, just, I, I can't really describe just the emotions. It, just absolutely fantastic. I was confident that we were going to win. You know, Denmark, really, we, we, they're a good side, but we should be beating Denmark nine times out of ten. So, yeah, I was confident. Meanwhile, students at Hazel Lee's Academy in Corby loved staying up a little longer on a school night and they're confident about the match on Sunday. I felt amazing because I really support England and it's just really wonderful to see them go in the finals. I'll be really excited and if England win, um, we're going to celebrate by... Um, watching the game as a whole family and having a barbecue. I think Harry Kane and Sterling, they're probably going to be the two people that are going to score for our team. And well, I'm pretty sure the score might be 2-1 to us. It's really cool because I could just, like, if I'm older and if I have children, I'll be able to tell them all about it. And the school's already making plans for next week, if England win. We're really excited about Monday here because on Monday we are going to have our very own Italy versus England match. So our year six children are going to be out here. We're going to have the whole school in their bubbles, socially distanced around the football pitch. And we're going to be watching the year six children play. They have assured me England are going to win.